Yeah, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. I want to welcome you guys to another episode of UFC 4 Career Mode. Now it is episode. Yeah, um, yeah. Uh it's been a long road. Um, just to let you guys know, we are six wins in uh in the UFC. I am rank 13th. You guys see all that on screen. But I'm going for my lucky seventh win. But before we get into the fight, I wanted to tell you guys what I will be focusing on this video. What I've noticed is out of all the episodes that I've been making, I've kept it real short with you guys. I've actually been doing more of a playthrough than actually talking to you guys. So let's go ahead and change that. Um, the first thing that I want to do, honestly, is I want to check. Yeah, let's check Fighter Evolution, right? So what I've noticed is that I don't have any perks now i don't know why i don't have any perks but i guess i must have been slipping and forgot all about the perks but yeah um what we're going to do is we're going to focus on stamina perks this video now like i said i have a fight coming up um i've already went through camp i've done everything but for my next fight i want to take and utilize the entire camp to earn perks now i'm gonna tell you guys right now these perks, some of these perks ain't cheap. You got perks that are all the way up to 40 evolution. Now per camp, I might get about 26 to 30. So I know I'm not gonna get all these insane perks, but what I want my perks to do for me is help me with stamina. That is my only downfall because I throw so many punches and I've seen the comments. So many people say, yo, you need to block more. If I play a more conservative game, I guarantee you guys, you will get bored. I need to throw, I need to lick shots, I need to hit my target and knock him the f out. You feel what I'm saying? That's what I need and that's what I'm going for. So uh, let's go ahead and get into the seventh fight. All right, coming up next is the UFC Heavyweight Showdown. No more. Here he is making his way to the octagon. This is the first time in his UFC career he has worked his way to the main card. He has strung together some wins, looking at the rankings, and this guy appears like he belongs. A lot more eyeballs on him tonight. The audience is bigger. His popularity has grown leaps and bounds. We'll see if he can handle that pressure and perform the way he has that led to this main card slot here tonight. Yes, sir. I'm ready. Let's go. All right, so here we go early round one. And as many of you know, this is his first time on the main card. He's been a prelim machine mm -hmm. throughout his UFC career. I see you blocking. The have started to pile up, and now he's going to take his shots at one of the division's elite. More eyeballs. Obviously, mm -hmm. the crowd is full. Wait, what you going with? Yeah, my shots hit first. He can get off to a good start tonight. Big ball for Punch Land. Now we'll mm -hmm. back to range. Oh, he cut early? Okay. Ooh, nice. Mm. Get, get off, get off that, bro. Oh my god. Oh. Yeah, get on up, bro. Yeah. Right, come on. Want another one? Yes, sir. Come on. What you want to do? He does a great job of finding the placement on that shot. It is a great weapon to have. You know what? Let me go by. Oh, nice move. Mm -hmm. Big knee lands there. How it land? I blocked that. Oh, straight right. Come on. Oh, he gets tagged again. Nice combination. 
Come on. Let, help me work. Help me work. Ooh, the, 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 them boys gonna be bombs. Come on. What you got for me? Well, not much set up behind it. The right hook misses. Tags him with the left. Just out of range with that mm. right hand. Oh, and he just continues to punish his opponent with that hook. I'm not sure how many more. Nice move. He will not be able to take many more. He better understand yes, sir. that it only takes one in the perfect spot to end your night. And now he mm -hmm. goes with the combination Come of here. to the head. Potentially some concussive damage there. I mean, ah. the concussive damage. Landing all those strikes to the head. Uh -oh. He's very accurate. He's very fast. He has a real confidence every time he goes to punch. Yo, what are we? Hey, hold on. Oh, man. You gonna be one of those, bro? Yo, hey, yo, Chad, he trying to submit me. With 10 seconds left? Come on, what's wrong with this guy, man? Dang. Big body. That's a big body right there. Mm. Crazy joint to the head. Hey, yo, my, my strikes are definitely hitting first. Boom, big Superman. Ooh, 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 that might be the thumbnail. Let's go. All right. I'm a little tired, a little bloody. Let me see what my face looking like. Right, I, need to, I need to stop taking shots. It wasn't just the accuracy. It was the aggressiveness, the volume. It was unbelievable to watch him be so active. The cardio, the push, the pace, the pressure that he fought with. It's going to be very interesting to see if he can maintain this over 15 minutes. Come on, get up, bro. He's grabbing the back of the head. Pulling forward. All right, so now we're on the ground. Now he is in his wheelhouse. We'll see if he can get one of his submissions to pop here tonight. Oh, another brutal hook by him there. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. He was able to fight through mm. them in the previous round. Still plenty of time to go in this. Still plenty of time to go Come in Come on, bro. Round. You know I'm a headhunter. Be careful. One of those hooks will put him to sleep. Come on. Ha. Oh man. Is he is he is he going? Is he going? Okay, hold on. Alright, hold on, man. Nah. Oh my god. Oh my god, bro. All the ground and pound strikes continue to rain down. The opponent better move out of harm's way or the referee's gonna stop this. He better start to move. And when his opponent starts to posture, he needs bro. to get on the hip, push him away to try to escape this very, very Is he trying to go for a submission? Right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Well, working pretty effectively from the top here. Nice grounded pound by Alexio Lenick. Come on, bro. Man, this is some serious ground and pound. He's trying to put this dude's head like through the canvas. He's one of the better ground and pound fighters we have in the entire UFC, and you're seeing why. Here we go. He's having his way with him here. Oh my goodness. Well, he's got his back now. Olenek's back in full mount. Jesus Christ, bro. I mean, Literally, I mean, this dude is so whack, bro. 45 seconds remain in the round. What? Come on, man. Are you kidding me, bro? Bruh, come on, man. This dude, I'm knocking him out next round, man. Jesus Christ, bro. I'm taking this dude out next round, bro. Taking this, did he just kiss me, bro? Bro. I can't re- Yo, I want to replay, bro. Did this dude just kiss my forehead? 
Hey yo, hey yo, I'm knocking him the fuck out, bro. I'm oh I'm knocking him out, bro. Nah, I don't even care about none of that. You getting knocked out now, bro. Fuck you, bro. Yeah. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Oh my god, bro. Not again, bro. Oh my god, bro. Yo, are you... Yo, why he keep trying to go for a submission? This dude is so weak, bro. Are you kidding me, bro? I mean, how many can he take? Yo, this dude gets to throw shots and everything. The ground game sucks, bro. Oh my god, bro. What? 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 Are you kidding me, bro? Yo, 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 I'm stuck. Oh, my God, bro. You cannot stay in the guard of these great jiu-jitsu guys. All right, so he postures up. Now he's okay. Now he's going to escape. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. See if he can apply pressure inside his opponent's guard here, DC. Oh, he postured up there, gained some valuable separation. And now the ground and pound starts. Well, you gotta he won't even let me up, bro. Doing it here. Nice punch. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Really timing his shots nicely. Good time. I hope I win this fight, bro. Yeah, he did a great job of I hope I did good, bro. Cause goodness gracious, man, this dude kept me on the ground forever. I know he didn't get the finish. I mean, they they give him all the replay to me. And he showed that he's one of the best fighters in the this world. This is a nail biter, yo. Oh my god! Unanimous decision, and this dude had me on the ground forever. <laughs> Let's go. Oh man. Wow, bro. Wow. I cannot believe I won that fight. I cannot believe I won that fight at all. Well, now that that fight is over, it's time to take another fight. I got social media buzzing once again. A lot of my haters are coming out saying a win is a win. Now is what's up. What, oh, man. What a boring fight. That's what they're going to say to me. That's crazy. After everything that I've done, bro, that is crazy. So, look. Let me check out these fight offers, man. Um, I haven't really been ducking anybody. Um, 30K a show. Uh, let me see. 6'3", 69. Dang, this boy on his way out. He's 37. You know what? Let's, let's go ahead and accept his fight. We're going to do five weeks of me gaining evolution points. 
so what i'm going to do is i'm going to go ahead and uh start everything um basically let's hype up the fight real fast that's what i'm gonna spend uh some of my stuff on let's see sponsorships i have all right, i gotta do meet a fan promotions um get your fans hype post a social um let's see podcast fight hype uh let me see all right let's go meet a fan all right two mandatory promotions they're mandatory oh god all right so i have to do them all right so uh local interview all right that's my entire first week thanks these things were mandatory yeah all right so uh now that week one is done um i gotta go to the next week at least we got a medium fight hype here now i can focus on sparring <laughs> jesus all right so uh let's see heavy bag actually uh no, i don't want to do arm bars 30 percent increased uppercuts yeah i'll take that all right bet I'm about to knock the next dude out all uppercuts. As soon as I get in there, I'm going to just hold the block. As soon as he come up, bing! Bing! bing. I'm going to be throwing uppercuts like crazy. Watch me. But first, you got to get these perks right. You know what I'm saying? Now, I know I can't, I can't hype up the fight. I think I only got like five uh, points left for the week. Yeah, I can't hype up the fight. But let's go ahead and check out Fighter Evolution. All right. All right. So let's see. Straight Superman spinning punches are faster, more accurate. Cool. Strikes consume less stamina during rounds one and two. Uh, sways while still, I don't know. Faster movement. Mm, untouchable. Mm, faster movement. Mm, recovery stuff. No. Locks. No. Hooks, uppercuts. Um, mm, fast hands might be good. Uh, bulldog coming damage. Um, let's see. No, I got laser focus already. All right, I need to get higher altitude too. All right, no, nah, I don't want it. Oh, I might, I might need workhorse too, though. Workhorse costs eighteen. Mm. All right, so I know what I want. All right, so the first one out the gates, I'll take that. Um, and we're gonna put that right here. All right, now the next one. Where's it at? Where's it at? Okay. All right. What else we got? Where's it at? Where's it at? Higher altitude. That's the one I want. All right. And we still have 20 left and I have to become a UFC champion to unlock that, which means I will use the rest of my evolution points to get something else up. Cause I know I need it, man. So stand up. Um, let's see. Punch power, punch speed, fully maxed out. Takedown defense is really up there. I don't know why I still be getting taken down. Um, determine speed of bottom transition sweeps and reversals. Um, let's see. Yeah, let's work on let's work on a bottom game. My, my bottom game really needs help. <laughs> Coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight division collision. Well, we really don't see a lot of guys in MMA with boxing skills on this level. He certainly could have gone on to great things as a professional boxer, but he believes he has the best hands in the sport, and he will be looking to prove as much here tonight. And he has the background to prove that, right? He's not saying something that is not true. 
he does have the ability to say that. He can say he has the best hands in the game because he has shown it. And when you watch him box, when you watch a guy go into a fight with this young man and think that it does not matter what his credentials are, he is going to stand with him and prove that he's better, they usually will go to sleep because no action is wasted. The jab starts it all. He fights behind this beautiful, educated jab, jabbing high, jabbing low, and then the overhand right is unbelievable. It's his kill shot, he calls it, and he lands it all the time. All right, so here he is, one of the more popular fighters on this UFC roster, top to bottom, the heavyweight contender, the Black Beast, Houston's finest, Derek Lewis. Yeah, Derek Lewis is a phenomenal fighter, but he's just a fighter at heart. From the hardships that he had as a kid to his youth, developing and overcoming so much adversity to become a guy that has fought for the UFC Heavyweight Championship is truly inspiring for anyone that looks. You ready? Uh, you ready? Well, ready to go here for round one. He won his Number. last fight by decision. It was dominant, but the finish didn't materialize. Now with momentum, he is ready to make another UFC start. Can he get the finish tonight? A stoppage would certainly be useful as he tries to I ain't gonna to lie. His, his, his shots is pretty fast. Well, he has certainly found the range and staying pretty busy here on the field. He's being Ooh. busy, but it's also the timing and the accuracy that's allowing him to land so many attacks. And they separate. With that punch, no good. Oh! He's hurt. Serve him up. Go mm -hmm. get him. Oh, he might be out. Come on. Oh, my stamina coming back fast. Come on. Come on with it. All right, so he lands another jab now, just snapping that thing off. I believe that. Oh, my God. Get your ass up. Come on. You know what I want. You know what I want. Oh my God. <laughs> Please let him. Oh, that was nice. I ain't gonna lie. Oh, shit. Get off the cage, bro. Man, get up. I can't get up. Oh, my God, bro. I was supposed to knock you out, bro. Oh, my God. He going? He night night chat. He said bye bye, baby. Hey, I am a bro. What? The machine, boy. Sheesh. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, look at look at him. Say good night. There's no one that can come save you. You are out like a light. He going, yo, he was going, Jack. He was going. <laughs> no, go. <laughs> Let's go. Listen, I want to thank everybody for watching this episode. I know it was kind of lengthy. Thank you guys so much for sticking around to the end. We got new perks, which is just going to make me a better striker. I still got to work on my ground game. Now that I have my perks, I'm going to put all my evolution points into staying off the ground and actually having an advantage from the bottom. So I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. Peace.